Joe Radinovich celebrated a convincing primary win in Brainerd last night. Radinovich took in 44% of the vote in the primary, easily topping runner-up Michelle Lee, who had 27%. That gave Radinovich the Democratic nomination in the race for U.S. Congress District 8. Radinovich, who grew up in Crosby, ran on the premise of fighting for working-class people, ensuring universal health care, and access to good education. He also pledged to take no contributions from corporate PACs in his campaign. I will not stop fighting for you. In fact, we're just getting started here. That's what's going on. Tonight, tonight we made history, not just here in the 8th, but across the state of Minnesota. Did you see that turnout? Radinovich will face Pete Stauber, who won the Republican nomination last night. Stauber is heavily backed by the Republican Party. Vice President Mike Pence stopped in the district to fundraise for him last week. The two will campaign to win District 8, which encompasses the Arrowhead region and much of the Iron Range. right for Minnesota. That means standing with our colleagues who have a good idea, whether they're on our side or the other side. We're going to stand up and speak out against the bad ideas that hurt the middle class. We're going to stand up for the things that build the middle class. That's what we're doing here tonight. That's what we're doing from here to November. I'm honored to have your support. Here we go. Let's go. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.